currently in John TM. And I fancy going to CPP Island. So, I have a choice. Do I get a train? Do I fly? Taxi? No. Come up with an idea. Let's buy a scooter and drive on the scooter a thousand kilometers to the south of Thailand. Everybody's telling me I'm mental, but we already knew that. So I'm gonna give it a go, see how we get on. Just about to get loaded up in the steed. My new purchase. Loaded up, strapped up, hopefully. Won't have any issues with it falling off. Got phone soap ready. Should be alright. Don't think it's going anywhere. What do you think? So, already had to make a stop. About 25 kilometres in. Google Maps is trying to take me on the motorway even though I've said avoid them. So we've had to switch to wise, see how we go on there. Quick refreshment break. Ready cab. Ciao. for a second stop 100 kilometers in going all right to be fair loads of traffic though bit of kfc bit of fuel and a bit of coffee how are you feeling hot uh, hot <laughs> oh very hot there we go again next leg peace out Already into day two. Didn't bother updating last night by the time I got to Wahin. Fucking knackered. A couple of beers, a bit of food, and bed. But anyway, we're on the road already this morning. Been for a full English breakfast. Rose Garden, Wahin. Highly recommended. Just made the first stop of today. Fueled up with a bit of the good stuff, bit of the Shell V power. 400 kilometers in total today Been about 30 so far so big old journey in front of us sunburns coming on nicely so about another 100 kilometers in We've got a clue where we are quick 7-eleven break bit of save the arse and a bit of fucking fuel you know Standard everyday fuel that you need when you're doing a big bike journey. More fuel. So, made it to the next stop. Uh, how many miles? How many kilometres have we done? How many kilometres have we done? Five. 750 in total. 400 today. 400. 400 today. You feel tired? Yeah. Yeah. Uh, me too. Spliff break, then go have a shower. And then try and find somewhere for beer in this place. We're in the middle of nowhere, by the way. Where are we near? What? Where are we near? Where are we near? Suratani. Suratani. Oh, there you go. Suratani and Chupon. Day three of the epic cross Thailand journey. 
glad to be on the last leg today. Only 200 kilometers to go. Hopefully about three hours. We should be in Aonang. Woke up this morning to a dead lizard. Him and his mates keeping us up awake all night, partying, click, 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 all over. Fucking team of them outside my door. And that seemed to have all pissed off this morning. Gone to sleep now, they've kept me awake all night. If you don't hear from me again, I've been killed. I'm staying in the middle of nowhere. With a bung bat. I love you. So this is the trail you have to walk to get to the digs. But to be fair there is lights in the night, it's not that bad. But the view kind of is worth it and the location. Ooh. Oi. Chilling on PP Island. Nice morning stroll, the bifter. Checking out the clear water and all these little fish. Got a bung boat. Load the long tail boats. That's beautiful. Eh? So this morning guys were up early, got a private long tail boat chartered, went for a few hours this morning before everybody else while well, it's quiet, tired, you tired, sleepy law, sleepy. oh sleepy, unless you get up at this time in the morning you will never see PP Island, this dead, dogs running about, Birds flying about. Slight delay to the journey this morning. Bung Burke could have had a bit of extra time in bed. But there's not enough water for the boat to set off. So we've just got to wait about another 30 40 minutes. And we're just trying to find breakfast now. Which doesn't look like it's going to be easy. And the party island is shut. So I just had to come all the way back home to get my suntan lotion because Bungbert forgets that I'm after life and I need that tackle. So now off back to the boat. Good morning. By the way, 
this is the place, I'm not sure what it's called. It's just near here. This is the place for the shrooms. Magic mushroom smoothie. Highly recommended. Had a giggle. Mango mushroom smoothie. An actual rare sight on Fifi. Divers setting off. Got a two litre diesel going, 2007.
swim. Yeah. yeah. How deep? You know about this deep? Yeah, not so much deep. Actually, it's like that. Maybe here. Yeah, something like that. Miss Pratchinbury. Thailand. What year? 2020. 2020. 20 years ago. Miss Pratchinbury 2004, now old lady, but still look good. Still look beautiful. Work it, Mamie. People went the boat. A lot of people they want the private boat, you know. Yeah, yeah. Maybe not enough for the tourists now. If they put something here, they have to pay more. Yeah, yeah. They say, oh, I can't pay four thousand, five thousand. No, no, I have booking already. Sorry. <laughs> I know her. If they before they come here, what time? <laughs> you know, go with me. <laughs> then we cannot take another people. Yeah. Huh? How deep is it? Perfection. All the Phuket ferries and everything turning up now. Exactly why I set off first thing in the morning. Always come early in the morning. Private boat, I had to pay a bit extra. It cost me 3,000 baht for so about 66 quid for a couple of hours of heaven. I'm in, man. I'll try and get his link, stick it in the video for you guys.
well, a bit of a swim. Not done that in a lot of years. What a beautiful place. So, that's Maya Beach. Maya Bay, the beach, whatever. But over there, not actually a lot of swim over there. You can pay and walk around and look at a beach and the sea, and that's about it. So, we came here. Captain of the ship boarders. I think the guy knows what he's talking about. Where is the bungbert? Where is the bungbert? Where is the bungbert? Where is the bungbert? Oh, here she comes. Soon she can stand up. Soon she can stand. Good morning! <laughs> yeah, we can go inside, look. Look at all these stones people put. Someone's been collecting rubbish. Don't know how you get it out of here, like. But at least it's been collected. Oh, huge! Look at the size of that. Has it got a claw missing? Have a claw missing? Have a one. Not on that one this side. Mr. Crab, we're not here to hurt you. Ooh. I don't know, I'm going to go look. Deserted tropical island, kind of. 39% left on battery. Should be alright. Huh? Maybe go here, have a pee pee. Nobody swim. <laughs> Look funny, though. Scared of the sun. Drunk. Mal wave.
speed brake down. Come here, make sure our fellow motor's alright. Needs any help or all. Oh, brake chain. Back on terra firma. Now need what, darling? <laughs> oh, you feel ooh, you feel seasick. I feel hungry. Oh, you know what else I need? Can you guess what I need now? Can you guess? Something I need now. Ganja. <laughs> Back on terra firma. Time for ganja. 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 So now we are back, oh, feeling a bit tired, it's been a really good morning out, if you come up PP you've got to go on a private long tail boat, do a bit of snorkeling, a bit of swimming, something I've not done for 20 years, really enjoyed it, peace out. Well we are back, back on mainland Thailand. So, we are 200 kilometers into a 950 kilometer drive and we have decided to cheat. So we are now in Surat Thani, waiting for a train and the scooter for 35 quid is getting trained to Bangkok and for 55 quid we're getting first class sleeper train to Bangkok. No driving for two days solid. Oh, what do you think about that? Eh? What do you think about not driving for two days and cheating? Good. Very good. Very good to cheat. Yeah. Oh, yeah. So there you go. Bungbert's fault with cheating. Back to John TM. The best cocktail in Thailand.